And that is when I told them I am not G. And everyone left. Everybody else left. And that is the story of how I lost my third, third girlfriend. Truly, it was a tragedy, fit for the Greeks. Oh, was I not recording that? Oh my goodness. Let me just speak of me shit. glass of water. Fuck around with me door. Get over here. No, no. No, no, get over here. I get over here. Get over here. We're co-streaming now. We're co-streaming, yeah? Yeah. I go back with you. I go back with you. I go back you. Good boy. Ah, and that is why I liked my dog. He's small. I can bully him, and he can very much bully me into doing whatever the fuck he wants. But, ladies and gentlemen, let us let us continue. Last time around, we pulled uh, Johnny Silverhand just without the getting our soul trapped in a prison part, only to be revived fifty years later. Wait, what is this? Oh my god, it's it's becoming green because of overheating the copper wire. Some date might just explode. My my phone charger, which I inherited from my father. Uh, let's see. So we did the mission. We got back, and we talked with no one. So now we will talk with everyone. Alright, so not, no new dialogue here. Why did I, I... Oh my god. Okay, so I'll be... If I if I perform some missteps, it is because I have played Fallout 2 recently. Which is the main reason why I'm using the mouse to go around the screen. <laughs> Alright, so we talk... I have no idea. Do we have Inforce for sale? Yes. Now uh, you copy the astrology, put that on your PDA, and in its display, window fills with foreign words and symbols. And you know, with the Blood Mage's research, whatever it is, would be an easier as in initiating a data upload. Do it. And we walk away, gain some karma, become more rich. I'm pretty sure we have 50, you know. Lucha Dwyer, that he's tasked. Who the fuck is Lucha Dwyer? That is Lucky Strike. Uh, sure. Let's see what she has to say. Lucky <clears throat> Strike stands in her customary place, her gear found atop of near of a nearby bar stool. For once, she isn't smoking. She gives a small nod as you approach. Hey, Gentry. What's up? No at the manner of the called the Lodge? Do I group, you mean? Sure, I've done a few jobs for them. They pay well. The whole ominous secret organization thing they try to keep going is a little weird but whatever money is money and they've got it oh yeah recently they removed drag a shadow shadow run dragon fall from the twitch discovery page from a twitch category now they, this is an absence unsubstantiated source i think a youtube comment 
but this probably means because you can no longer get the not director's edition they just put the director's edition in and didn't transfer the 999 followers of the category to it and that's what the only thing that i noticed as for the unsubstantiated uh, source thing which is a youtube comment uh, i read once that twitch doesn't make its own categories well most of the most of the gaming ones because someone once asked why there isn't a picture for a game when looking at a category and the response they got is because they grab it from a different site that in the info about the game which could be true could not be true don't know so what can you tell me about the dua where best that i can tell he's just a middle run toady like any other corporate suit that you deal with before a run only difference is that his organization ain't a corp i think he's a little fresh face for what the launch is him doing in the beginning there was some uh, credibility issues i had a hard time taking the guy seriously but then he started waving vads and kneeing around and that cleared up everything in a flash I'm afraid I can't help you dig any deeper. He's an occasional client. Even if I knew about Dua, I wouldn't tell you. Shadowrunners which is until have a funny way of dying. Oh yeah, I've been meaning to ask, what's with the tattooed circuit trim? Could be a technomancer. That pretty boring. It is now. Wasn't always though. She stretches her neck so that the circuit pattern on her face can catch the light. What you're looking at used to be a tattoo magic. Done done when I was in Tokyo doing a job for the Yakuza. I am killing you, Yakuza. <laughs> That's a new one to me. Yeah, it was for me too. It's a meta magic thing, a way of putting in spells to a per person. Binding magic into the flesh so it's almost impossible to get rid of. Anyway, long story show, found a way to break it. Now it just looks like it looks pretty in the lamplight. Yeah, let's do that. Think so. The thing too, getting this thing removed would be a real fucking pain. Uh, why break the magic? Cur curse or something? Cursed! <laughs> Funny choice of words, but I guess it applies. When I went to work for the Yaks, they offered, no, they insisted that they let them ink me. Said I needed for the job. Long story short, the two the tattoo did boost my abilities, but they also branded me, marked me as a Yakuza property. And gave them and that gave them an easy way of tracking me from the astral plane. Damn. It was by the time I knew it was happening, it was almost too late to do anything about it. They found the solution. Wasn't pretty. What'd you do? A long list of unpleasant things, starting with killing the guy who inked me. The whole thing ended in a pretty dark place. The upshot of it is that I can't go back to Japan. Ever. But I used to get my autonomy back. So moral of the story, I guess, is uh, don't take every employer's word at face value. It's a lesson that every Shadowrunner needs to learn sooner or later. Some harder than most. Now, can we talk about something else? I'll see you around then. Yeah, I like you. I like veteran characters i don't know it it could just be me liking the military structure ah here's the old timer telling us the story of how they earned their medal how they dealt with this shit in their day back in my day we had two sticks and a rock and we had to share a rock welcome back to ammunition got chance need weapons what do you got the super war hawk. I'm telling you, gents. In my current campaign, I use a war hawk and I grab myself a FN. FN ha. And man, load this bitch with incendiary rounds. Load this bitch with silver. Pack, pack with me. Uh, what's where is it? Where is it? 
Oh, look at that. Oh, no. Black Stork 28 in the mag. Oh, man. I'm missing out. I think I got a Beretta. That's my backup. And I have the ammo for it 50 50 split between Incendiary and uh, the Whatchamacallit because of. Which is why not? Now I could grab myself a fucking shuriken. <laughs> but nah. I have 10k. Holy shit, let's buy ourselves some actual good shit. Yeah, 12 damage. Uh, ain't, ain't all that good as specialists. One strain, 5 HP is just super good. One range combat. Nah, 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 nah. I stick with what I have. And I remain happy. Okay, so what is this? AG Chemi Europa. Okay, let me just notify the guy at the coffee shop that the job's done. Job's done. Off I go then. Hey, it's it's the chick. Man, been drinking last night. Can't feel the after effects. Didn't drink enough. Eh. <clears throat> Things are alright. Good. Nope, they stay that way. Now let me know if he, if they don't though. I'm always up for providing that map though. But now, gotta help out the uh, more though. See you around, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Never play the game of Secret Hitler. One day I will. Welcome back, Renner. Door to the exit. He'll fall in line. After he gets his pants dry dry cleaned first. Excellent work. Perhaps you do have a future in this town. Here is your pay. I have no idea what this does. Maybe it's bad. Maybe the lodge is working against monitor. Maybe it's not. I don't know. The third flashes his wry smile and winks at you knowingly. I am told you have been twizzy of late, O oh, Wanderer of the Shadows. My street lads tell me that business is picking up. Is that man who is taking over for Monica? Bulagazi? Who does it look like? You're too early? <laughs> the Pope from the Vatican? I give him a soy calf, a big one, and put it on my account. I like the cut of his I like the cut of his jib. A large suit of my, you are the generous one. Dolce Mota. Why did I go French? Don't Swift. Are you sure you can afford such a gesture? The fat man frowns. And the stone, I was going to say. And the stone as well. Nothing is too good for. As you desire, or oh, ample one. The man is a moron, but he eats his weight in but lava and pastries. So who am I to cheer? <laughs> Give me a Turkish coffee. We're still in time. Uh, ten times more expensive, but ten times better. Is what I tell myself. But it's just letters on the screen, man. Oh yeah, we also played some Sekiro after we downed a few beers and a couple of shots. What can I say? I'm... God, baby, I'm the second coming of Jesus Christ. Or the third coming, since he was the second coming of himself. Nah, just kidding, just kidding. Alright, so... I thought you would do this job. I've, I have forgotten what the job is. I'll be filled in on the way. Imagine that, you don't do a job. Actually, I do believe that that is what happens when uh, when you play tabletop. Let's do a job. Two weeks later, on your next meeting. Okay, so what we're going to do again? Said the leader. Fuck. Okay, uh, the classic. Need him. Need him. Always need these two. Why? Always need a fucking shaman. Always need a deck check. Sometimes need a red deck. And then you just have your good choice of do you want one or the other damage type. And it's usually close range and 
range. Dungeon and I will remember the name. Ow. Oh, I will remember the No, I have to I have to fight find the file on my computer. You think I am joking? I am not. Gaichu. I have a picture. I have a picture of the man. Do not ask why. Do not ask why. You are asking too many questions for your own good. Oh my goodness, fucking gracious. Actually, let me just disable that. Alright, where is it? Oh. Oh, you can't do this to me. Activity. Hmm. No, no, it needs to say streaming, not playing. Hmm. hmm. Oh well, just gonna, just gonna have to block all of it, I guess. Eh, always like a little healing. You know, sometimes you just can't heal, and shit happens. And uh, I like this chick. <laughs> ah, monolith, plastic, sterile. The Berlin office of E.G. Chemai Europa. Is all of these things and more. The worst quality of modern corporate culture. All mixed into a toxic stew. Slowest into a single prefab office building. Thankfully, you shouldn't have a long stay. According to the intel that your client provided. It should be a simple smashing glab operation. And you've been given the tools to carry it out with a minimum of fuss. The MKV-6 prototype. Whatever it is, is a wait no new on the twenty fifth floor. Time to go and get it. Ah, oh, let's go, baby. Look at me. Ah, sixty FPS. All right, what's this? Uh, flash, high explosive. Look at the twenty damage compared to the store box, which is sixteen. Then remove one of those. And grab you. Hmm. All right. Did we upgrade enough that we can throw grenades? You have one spent karma. Let me use my two karma. Hmm. What am I going to upgrade? Maybe. Hmm. What is it? Uh, spirit summoning. Yes. Spirit point visible. Hmm, let me just upgrade my killing hands. Ah, oh, perhaps can equip class C drones. Is it a is it a 50 cal sniper rifle we have there? No no, are those class 4 plates? Enemy HP visible. Intelligence. Yeah, here it is. Alright, so in in the in the game I am a part of. There's this, there's this nun character. Possessed by some demon, I think. And now, oh maybe she's just a sadistic bitch, don't know. I haven't, I haven't read the piece of media that she is from. And so she got this, she can read minds, you know. Which is, you know, why, uh, why we leveled wisdom to the level we did. 
so I can just show up, say, here is the reason you can't read my fucking mind. Is it meta gamey? Fuck no. She can read minds. She should be able to read my mind when I say I'm going to shoot her. Let, let, let me just... Let me just take two seconds. To see who runs the character. So I can send this there. As a threat. Yes, as a threat. Alright, screen name. So, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, I will find her. And I have Ochella. Rachel, no, Absol, Jossie, Poon, my no, where is she? Who, where's the simp? Where is the simp? Graeme, John, Tolkien, Nathan, Virtus, Mono, Chow, Tordilia, who the fuck is Tordilia? Tordilia, what? She is a witch. What? Where is this character? Oh, I will find this bitch. Oh, I will make this. Ah, here it is. It's Havoc. Of course, it's Havoc. Okay, so Havoc. Alright, give me, give me like two seconds. I need to... Oh! Oh, it's the... Ch oh, it's the Chaves. Oh, that makes sense. That makes sense. Anyways, uh, back to what I was doing. <clears throat> Havoc, are you listening? This is a message. I am sending you this message as a threat. Attempt to use your waifu, your fucking demon-possessed nun, against me. And I will simply link this video again and again to slowly show you the ever-changing character sheet as I slowly pull a gun and say to your chat that reads minds, your mental chat goes into me mind, meets a wall that says meat slab. In the meat space, Crochet is there with a sil with a bullet and a silver with a gun and a silver bullet loaded. Looking at you, motherfucker. Looking at you This is a credible threat, I will shoot the nun. She will meet the god of this dimension. And there is nothing you can do to stop it. Same goes for the ghoul. Same goes for any vampire, zombie, or any credible threat. I am a shadow runner. You will die. And now I uh, clip that. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> What the, what? No, 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 no. Okay, so I need to open up a new instance. And then click clip. Boom! Easy as that. Okay, so this is something I'm gonna have to do after. Unlucky, unlucky, but uh, 23rd minute. I am having. I have a piece of paper next to me. 
and on it I have just timestamps of ship. Okay, so we need to reach the 25th floor. Uh, back to game. Whee! Back to game. Uh, I can stop threatening. Uh, can, no, no, no. Let me just. Let me. No, I need to send it. I, I will send my threats. And that I I just informed the son of a bitch that I'm sending him uh, that I will be sending him threats, and there is nothing you can do to stop it. I am going. I am a psycho. I am going crazy. I'm going crazy. I'm going insane. But the gesture of the king is one and the same. After a few moments of shifting through cables, you find the diagnostic connector with the right input to fit the little black box that her ship gave you. Plug in the little black box. The connector slips into the box with a satisfying click. A tiny red light set into the box. Sizzling lid begins flashing. A few seconds later it turns a solid yellow and then finally shifts to green. At that instant all of the lights in the garage turn off. A few moments later, the emergency lighting kicks in. If what Smith told you was true, you've just killed the main power for most of the building. That backup generator will be turned on any moment. There's no time to lose. In theory, the bar source has circumvented the security cameras or the video and separate floors. You should be able to intercept the camera feeds by tapping into the elevator console on the 24th floor. Handy little thing, all right? Let's go. Ah, I love it when the person sending us to do a job gives us everything we need. <gasps> Medical supplies, my goodness gracious. It's like they're expecting a firefight. Project Atlas. I don't like things that have great names on them. They're usually spooky. Very spooky. When have you ever heard of a project named after something great that went well? Ah, here's Project Hercules, where we made super soldiers. Oh no, we made zombies! Here's Project Cerberus, Cerberus where we're gonna make a defensive AI. Oh my god, the AI is taking over the world! Let's see. Here's Project Bed of Sticks. My god, we have trapped the souls of everyone. Dying and it's trying to explode. There are so there are cool names, but I'll be fucking damned if Project Hades! No! Watch out! It's the white phosphorus! What can I say? I was a theater kid back in kinder. <laughs> All right. Without warning, your comlink screen bursts into static. You hear a telltale series of clicks. Someone has established an audio connection to your comlink. A moment later, a deep, sonorous voice speaks into your ear. You recognize it instantly. It's your large contact, Lota Dwar. Dwar. Ah, oh, Atroche, do not speak. Let's listen. I have a proposition to you. I understand that your team is currently en route to retrieve a package, the MKV-6 prototype, if I'm not mistaken. My associates and I are interested in acquiring... Oh, no, no. Sorry. Sorry, man. I have a job. I have one rule. No matter what I do. Unless the game tells me explicitly, you know. But not, it's not like it's going to take away the choice. But, you know, it's pretty implied what's the, what the game wants you to do. I will do what my employer has said. Why? I don't fuck over my employer. Unless that it, unless fucking over the employer is better for me. Unless not fucking over the employer will kill me. Damn, I need to, I need to clean the dust from my room, man. I need to clean the dust from my room. Mm. 
I like the I like the what is vision of this. My associates are still firing the MKV search. Ah, no, 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 no. Once you you will be uh, spawned there, you will find the transport part beside your client's van. Load, no, nah. Third step now, offer simple procedures instructed return, and uh, that we will need undamaged. <laughs> Hold up on a uh, 14 second. What's going on? Another calm from uh, contact amount. His organization wants the MK6 for themselves. They're offering a lot of money. Not sure how much I feel about the boss. We need, we need the money and all, but I'm not betraying. Yeah. Hirschman will get what he wants. I just want to know in case any fallout from this decision comes drifting back our way. Ah, that's what I... That's the call I would make. Damn! Now we should consider this, Chief. If we're gonna collect Alice's fee in time, save our... Bro, we already made the fee! I know how we're passing it up. Ah, this is this is why I like him. Blitz is more self-centered. While Dietrich is more for the group. Gives me a real good perspective. And then we have Glory in the back. Doesn't give a shit. I have no... I know nothing about it. But I hope after this job, we will finally be able to learn something. I need that. I, I thought maybe of doing shots today. I don't know why. I mean, drank three shots last night. Could still walk down and up the stairs. And before any of you say it's some store-bought low alcohol shit, 50% pure. Made by my grandpa. So don't you be accusing my grandpa of not knowing his liquor. Of his rakia. That will be the last comment you make before I ban you from this chat. This is the chief. All cameras, feeds are ready. Shall I? When I wait for a spot, she taps a couple of keys on the console and your PDA retrieves signal from around the building. Now it's finally way upstairs. Ah, oh, camera 12, 13, 14. My goodness gracious. I mean, there's a lot of black spots, you know. But most of the intro. Yeah, they got the hallways all checked. Yeah, this is. I, this is spooky. This. Yeah, this I hate. It's not a corridor, it's a room, which is why I hate it. I'm gonna open this door, there's gonna be a guy here. Load. Containment director. Okay, so we need to find ourselves a way upstairs. Laboratory entrance. I mean, we'll just... Uh, go here, there's a dead guy. Why is there a dead guy? No! There, is there a rival team? Is there a rival team here somewhere? I right, just GOG telling me of exclusive discount code. A warning light strobes out of console at your approach. Large white letters straight out against red background. Warning toxic containment de detected. Trotso 12. Fosh gene gas. Has this material override engaged? Laboratory entrance to lockdown. Input command. Purge air. Warning this action will result in the ventilator containment to exterior atmosphere. Yo, Blitz, all you. At the instant, more of powerful fan felt. It was the uh, paper on a loose object within the lab begin to flutter and roll as powerful wind strips the rest. Atmosphere purge, containment's detected, disengaging lockdown. And just so like that, we can enter the laboratory. Wonder what happened. There's the drone, slow. 
Slow and steady wins the race. Alright, so what the fuck did you... Something so is dead was at a small power smash last and a number of breakers have been knocked over in the nearby... Beakers have been knocked over. Over at the nearby table. Oh, chill, let's see what he was working on. This computer is powered on, but in sleep mode. When the stream comes to life, you find a half-written file of text on it. The timestamp is... Of the most recent, that was it's been a few minutes ago. I didn't sleep last night, doesn't look like I'm going to sleep tonight either. The last test batch failed, my fault. I got the Mitch to wrong. Sloppy word, Jensen. I can barely keep my eyes open. Got, got to try again though. No excuses in this office. I despise the relying on stimulants, but I've got no choice. Got to keep going. Progress marches on. Now, uh, that game we played, uh, what's it called, what's it called? Dread Delusion. Uh, soon we will be coming out with a 1.0 update. Finally we might see what the fuck the floating lady in the, in the trailers is. So I'm happy about it. Start a new batch tomorrow. If House and Falls Pet isn't ready to be tested tomorrow, well, best not think about that. Got to concentrate. Remember, rely on safety. Keep alert, keep awake. One more move to spell a design. It's that. Ah, uh, Jim. Looks like, dead. Looks like that's when he died. Ah, uh, Jim. Uh, two weeks ago. New former, former 17. So I named this former. Must have known imagine 17. Honest one. Well, it's, it's easy. Once you get it working well, then you can start giving it cool names. Can't have Project Hercules fail now, can you? Still can't want to start working on from Wonder Bread and early clinical tech. The trials were promising the extreme. Amazingly potent, this stuff. An increased potency means less pro frequent injections. A lower dosage, there's not nothing. Last week, last week. Tailoring doses to individual patients has worked wonders. The Chia was taking a gene therapy based approach. They've been using it in medical medicine for ages, so why not apply the same logic here? So in a nutshell, I've used the subject's own DNA to delude their immune systems into believing that Formula 17 belongs in their bodies, simple and effective. This approach has helped increase the Formula's absorption rate, as well as significantly reducing incidence of rejection. Unfortunately, it also rules out any easily mass-produced product, but I am convinced that the results will justify the additional costs. And yesterday, a week! He waits an entire week before telling me that tailoring the mixture is an unacceptable solution. And then he tells me that the trials are beginning tomorrow. I have no time. And the Gearspurge bastards are applying so much pressure that I can barely think. Bastard! Halshafoff probably tried to tame all of them to rot. Maybe now Halshafoff plays the heat, the sheets with Gearspurge's sector. He'll learn to lighten up. We can only hope. Anyway, I have no ideas to move forward with the farm mode with leader fire first, possibly even dangerous, but if I don't start producing some results, I get the feeling that I'll, it won't be my problem for much longer. Wish me luck, journal. It's science in time. <laughs> it's science! No! No! It's science! He, they predicted... Why is it so tough? They, they, they predicted Morbius! They predicted Morbius! No! Note. Uh, the, mm, I'm still waiting for the report when I said hey sharp I meant I needed it yesterday stay until you've completed the tests then leave the report on my desk the code is five four one three nine do this tonight I expect to see more work tomorrow medicine supplies oh look another chip send it to me stash that's out yeah it's out Cool. So we got the code. Easy as that. Hey, look, camera. That's the elevator. That's the elevator. Uh, let's see. Let's try this way. I wonder what this is. Probably bathrooms. Access denied. Ooh. Five, four, one, three, nine. I am now interested in what this is. Since it says use magic. Hmm. 
Oh wait. Wait a bloody second. Summoning spirit control conjuring. So why can't he do it? I can use Blitz to bypass something else. Why can't I use Dietrich to open this? Oversight? Maybe? Hmm. Well, time to explore around. See what's happening. See what's what. Ooh, people. Caution, restricted area. Security room. Okay, so we are not going in there. And they probably won't be coming out here. But you know, we'll, we'll just have to wait and see. Ooh, what is this? Oh, library? Physical books? <gasps> Data store and records, of course, of course. My favorite. Perhaps this has uh, the layout of this entire fucking building. Ah, the archives. I would like to search the archives. Uh, shit. I have to physically type in shit? Damn, okay. Uh, MK... Yeah. Five, four, one, three, nine. People use the... Ah. Uh, how did I know? Because people use... Like to use the same easily remembered password for everything. Which is the reason why I have a book filled with notes of my passwords. Even for shit I no longer use, like my Microbolts account. For Origin. Remember Origin? Maybe you do. Maybe you're too young to remember fucking Origin. The bullshit that it was. And Microbolts, the the microtransaction, how it was. Welcome, hi, Stromback. Ah, uh, Chase, so those and the Project at it's, it's Project Atlas, my goodness. While you some information, begin to fill across the stream. Uh, to half of what you've seen has been redacted, and the rest is written in possibly dense corpse speak. Access visual record. Continue. It, it can be the it can be the same password. What? Oh, he doesn't have access. Holy shit! Now that is interesting. And in the back, nope. At least they still have physical books. A rarity in uh, Shadowrun. More or less. Since everything is mostly digital. I've re I despite playing the games a whole lot, especially Hong Kong, I haven't read any of the source books or done a lot of digging into the world. So I was like, oh, America. No, it's not called America, you moron. It's the United Canadian and American States, and there's only 30 of them. Uh, gee, I'm guessing that is the room of the guy we need. Ooh, drinks. And grab a bottle for the road. A socialite. Socialite. <laughs> Did I tell me I picked Shadow Runner etiquette? I will shoot myself. This it's 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 lore accurate to the character, but it's useless. Shadowrunner is the worst fucking edited in all of the games. Cheapoos. Yeah, we would, have, we would have grabbed a more expensive bottle if only we knew. If only we knew what we were looking for. At first glance, the stomach appears unremarkable. A password locked and a cheerful screensaver marches across the display. Upon closer inspection, though, you notice something interesting among the colorful Bouncing spreads of the screensaver, there is a symbol that you recognize. The dead drop marker of the... 
Shotgun Velenita. As you study this fire, green light wind sun above the terminal of fire, direct ordinate light of a pinhole camera. The strange savor disappears and the stream floods with a growing text. Stretcherman contributor number 1432 recognized. Welcome to Shay. Secret project. This is a open request for information about the project and material prototypes being developed at this facility. It is known that a synthetic drug is being developed here in support of Project Atlas. In addition, a functional prototype called MK6 has been developed. Holy shit, everyone wants this. The first contributor to provide us with the project data for Atlas, the chemical formula for this new drug, and the visual records of the MKV6 in operation will be handsomely rewarded. <gasps> Over Ooh. Ooh, interesting. AG Chem Europa is known to be a heartless corporation with little regard for metahuman safety or morality, as any corporation is. They guard their secrets jealously and seek to hoard all information gained from themselves, as any dragon will. Their pure cannot be allowed to go unpunished. What they all know, what they know, all shall know. No longer will they hide behind their secrets in the shadows. The timely delivery of this information will be well rewarded. Freedom! Equality, information, should I, I can't pronounce it. All right, so we need project data, formula, and visual records. If I was a better hacker, we could have gotten one of those. So let's uh, let's search for Atlas in here. <laughs> see what see what happens. Maybe we get what we need. Maybe not. Search the archive. Atlas. Uh, five four one three nine. Why? Thank you. Okay, so that solves that. We need the formula and visual records. Now those will be slightly harder to obtain. Hmm. There's something here. Oh, let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five of them. What is my security? I bet you I can do it. I bet you using the ever actually useful security etiquette I can get in there no charisma maybe strength in the security etiquette but first let's search this desk a stack of business cards on the desk reveals that it belongs to one Anita Shoida a terse research reveals that the desk drawings are stuffed full of lewd love notes or he's written on straps of art stationery. Uh, exploring Anita's desk is like embarking on an odyssey of filth. 30 seconds in, and you're already learning three new euphemism euphemisms for sex in a storage closet, as well as exciting new definitions for a variety of common office terms. Thankfully, your search also turns up something more Immediately valuable, a strap of paper with a name and a five digit code 84792. Excellent. Let's go use this code on something useful. Like Jet Naps is here. <laughs> Alright. Atlas. And this time around, we will use the new code, which is 84792. How should I match them? Okay. Ooh, it's actual visual records. Yes! Maybe. Oh, 
let's go. Let's go. Don't fuck your co-workers, baby. Because sometimes you're un... Oh, yeah. Also, lock your desk. Lock up. I have watched one video about, you know, es not espionage, more like uh, security. And what I've learned is if someone with a wheelchair is trying to enter the building carrying uh, some books in his lap, you say, fuck you, do you work here? You don't, you don't let them in. No, 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 fuck that. They can call you ableist, whatever the fuck they want. They might just be faking it. They might not even work there. They might try to steal from your company. Be suspicious of everyone. Lock your laptop. Lock your desk. Tell everyone to do so. See someone suspicious? Tell a security. You're... It's your first day in the office and you see someone doing something incredibly suspicious? Fuck it, you're the new guy. Just call security, tell security, yo, that guy's weird. And the security will say, that's that's Jim. He always does that. What about the guy next to him? Oh, I don't know him. Thank you for informing me. Here's your raise that you got for being such a good intern. Oh wait, you're not being paid because you're an intern. Well, sucks to be you then. Wee! Ah, uh, Jim. Uh, too many words. Ah, uh, Recordings of a laboratory experiments on metahumans. Chill them all, burn the company. Nuke the place like we did the last building. Images of extensive series of cyber surges being performed upon a large troll, of course. Of course, of the same troll carving his way through opponents with a massive axe, of course. And a gun cam footage from what appears to be a vehicle mount and chain gun. The weapon has been photographed, tearing apart a variety of targets, both artificial and organic. Well, 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 let me just grab a copy. Uh, ah, chain. Well, it was, uh... It was good to check as well. But yeah, we got what we need. Hmm. Also, drones are being heavily underutilized. At least I think. Alright, we still need to find a way, you know. Project Atlas folder. Okay, we open it. Move to a digital archive, large than reserved utilization. Wow! Okay, so we got that. Now for the big question. Oh wait, we probably, you know, just go back to the elevator, use the code in the elevator, and move forwards. No, it takes us down. Okay, okay. So, let's see. If I was a set of stairs, where would I be? Well, close to the elevator. So why is the set of stairs not close to the elevator? Oh, wait! It is! It's right here, just down the hall. We just need to use the other code. What can I say? Wait. Uh, wait, a, wait a fucking second. What sort of creatures leave astral residue? when they interact with things. Hmm? Oh, 792. There we go, M missed by one. Ah, it's an elevator. We don't get the stairs, we get the elevator. Damn, what about fire safety? One in case of a fire, you're forked. Mega Corporation, don't care. The elevator whisks you upwards towards the executive level 25th floor. As expected, the run has been relatively smooth sailing so far. A chime breaks the silence as the elevator slides to a stop. 
MK6 is somewhere on this floor. All that you have to do is find it. All right, we got all the info we need. Oh, oh, oh. emergency lights went out, leaving you in darkness. A moment later, the building's light flip on, cranked all the way up to full illumination. The light is uncomfortably bright. A quick check of your comment shows that your security feed has been terminated. Instead of a command view of the 24th floor, you find yourself staring at a fucking black screen. Well, shit. Should we have busted into the security room and killed them all? Or pretended to be something we're not? Maybe. Maybe. But a security would have been alerted, maybe. No cameras so far. Hmm, pretty thin level. Well, we are on the top floor. Anyone got any parachutes? Ah, I've been expecting you. No. No! It's him! It's him! He's back for a third round. You wanna tussle with a muscle? Oh, I'm gonna show you something you haven't seen before. The door slides open with a pneumatic shiss. An enormous figure fills your vision. It stands motionless by a console in the corner of the room. Never mind. It is not what I was expecting. It is something else. Almost every inch of this thing is covered in dull steel and gleaming chrome. It's mechanical arms and then articulated hands that work out. And then one looked out of place in an industrial machine. Bulky, cumbersome things designed for crushing power rather than finesse. Clutched in one of those hands is a chain gun that we saw the tests of. And that shouldn't be possible. Nothing can be implanted with that much chrome and live. Yeah, this isn't right. Stay cool, guys. It isn't moving. I think it's, uh, I don't know, on standby or something. The lights are on, but nobody's home. The fidget stands completely still, with its eyeless head. Fidgets in agitation. Something about it reminds you of a snake taste in the air. Off to one side, a strain of control turns a rose cheerfully in the gloom. Well, you know what they say. Get the job. No attack yet. Blitz. Tell me we can shut it off. MTV Sit Cyber Zombie Prototype Control Console. You have got to be kidding me. They gave Ghoul's Chrome activate the console. This MKV search prototype is exclusively property of AG Chemi Europa. Unauthorized access is prohibited. To put the prototype into demonstration mode, you may activate its systems from the following menu. Alternatively, the system can be directly piloted via remote control reg. Press any key to continue. Blitz's eyes go wide. Chief, did, did you just read that? I am going to drive the hell out of this thing. <laughs> Hold your horses, Blitz. Please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fine, read up. But after you're done, I'm gonna do my thing. I'm in. How many ridges can say they piloted a true zombie cyber demon, bruh? So this is what they meant. Oh, we wanted undamaged. We'll talk about this later. For now, let's get this out of our hair. He steps back, allowing you to continue your attention back to the control. Input command. Glory, you're the medic. Do your thing. Glory nods and steps forward. As she stands next to the cyber zombie, we can't help but notice how much chrome withers her own body. Her old chrome. I mean, look at those hands. Look at those shoulders. Hmm, the cyberware is high grade. 
quality stuff, but not mil spec. The arms look industrial in design. Interesting choice, but there's nothing wrong with it. Ah, control system looks interesting, like a drone control interface. It's wired into the base of the skull. Yeah, the central neural cortex, as they call it. From the position, you know, say it's directed direct to the thing's brainstem. And Lori takes a close look at the cyber zombie's control module. A moment later, she takes a sudden half step back. She turns to look at you with a disgusting look on her face. Trisha, listen to me. We have to kill this thing. Uh, this thing is our payday. Explain. This, this troll is still conscious. He's still conscious. They, they outfitted him with an inhibitor chip. Oh, fuck. He's trapped in his own body, streaming to get out. This isn't a prototype, it's a person. We can't just cash him in for a paycheck. Can you do something about it? Help him in some way? She takes another look at the control module, Stalin. No promises, but I can try. In, I did say I want to learn about Lori. So, she's a humanitarian, more or less, when she's not slicing up people. She's our medic. We know nothing about her. So, in the interest of self-interest, do it. Not here. I was jumping out to the garage first. Now, I want to have the van close by in case anything goes wrong. I want to have a giant pile of steel between me and the cyber zombie. Yeah, in the meantime, we're going to have to activate him. Just remember, Shay, that's, uh, that's a man you're giving orders to, not a machine. Well, read me file. Ah, okay, demonstration model. This prototype incorporated top of the line. Cyberware from all AJ. Shemi Europa subsidiaries, including Zeiss Deadsight, Laser Designator, but Heavy BUT, Heavy Industries, Powerlift Industrial Cyber Arms, and the brand new Zeiss Sun Shell Cyberstall. When necessary, competitors' products have been incorporated into the platform. Aries Dermal Platen, Universal Omnitech Move by Wire, blah blah blah. These systems should be considered placeholders for this proof of concept prototype. Of course, of course. The biological component of the MKDI was selected for size and durability by General Genetic Worldwide. All autonomous functions necessary to maintain the biological component are originally original to the component itself and should self-regulate within operational limits. As proof of concept demonstration model, the MK6 was designed for remote operation, as Zeiss in the I in the sky drone control system has been incorporated into the project stall. Comlet control is also possible for casual control, but for production demonstration purposes, use of the drone control system is advised. Armaments, the MKV-6 prototype, comes equipped with the Ares Vanquisher vehicle rotary cannon to demonstrate the actuated strength of the prototype and recall suppression capabilities. This model is also equipped with a global polymers monofilament axe. For demonstration purposes, this weapon has been designed with a hefty well, heft well beyond the lifting capacity of any unaugmented metahuman. The MK6, of course, should swing it, but it is. Long term goals demonstration of the MK6 capabilities in this office hope that AG Chemi Europa's newly Develop Formula 17 cybernetic reagent will prove valuable to the board of directors, both as an astonishing technical achievement as a, and as a lucrative stream of revenue. Money! Let's do your thing. Most ships have certainly dispatched the cyber zombie into his drone control network. This is a uh, strange chief. The cyber zombie's massive hands flex twice, and it takes a half step forward. Its mouth twists into a wide grin. But uh, I think I can get used to it. Alright, you hit the activation button and the cyber zombie launches to life. It takes a step forward and you can hear the rear of actuators calibrating to adjust its weight. 
A few seconds later, the whirling sound dies and it drags into a slight crouch. I've got it, Chief! The MK6 is under my control! But somehow the team's re. The reactions feel off somehow. Almost like there's something else in here with me. I'm not surprised, but we can talk about it later. For now, we should try to straighten getting out of here. Okay. Do we have the technical data thingy? Well, well, well. Would you look at that? A couple of dead people. Look at this red guy in the back. Oh, sorry. Decker. But he's soon to be dead. Knight Errant Captain. There is five of you, five of us. It's Cyber Zombie. Kill them all. The Knight Errant takes a half step towards you. Magnified by his mask's speaker. His voice comes out. Like the roar of some great beast. Drop your weapons and stay away from the prototype. Do it now. I've got a better idea. You drop your weapons and I don't, and I don't order Tin Man here to fucking kill you. The night there and pauses for a moment before responding. When he speaks, his voice is a dripping with scorn. Try it. See what happens. Don't mind if I do. Target spotted. Active in remote control. Greg. What did you say? Remote control. What? Big man. He can designate target. Beep boop beep motherfucker. Beep boop beep. He can enter cover? This is unreal. This is unreal. Ah, uh, let me just pull out the axe the size of your fucking head. Uh, burst fire. Or full auto fire. Uses 10 bullets. Has what well, cap 30. You cannot tell me this thing holds 30 bullets. Only 30 bullets. Look at this round. He's oh he's so dead. Alright, alright. Control mode. Alright, time to do a little setup. Of course their mage is already on the fucking ley line. What did I expect? I'm watching the park. Gen target the cyber zombie. Oh, because he's got too much cruel magic can't affect them. Because he has no essence and because he's dead. No, he's alive, but you know what I mean. Hmm. 80% maybe. <laughs> oh, let's do this. Oh, let's do this. Okay. Drone. Who can kill him, man? What? Oh, it's headshot. Okay, so the Ranger is our main priority because I have a very big suspicion that he's gonna try to take control of the big guy. And I don't want that happening. So we're gonna kill the mage first. As you often do, you know. Just Okay, as for glory, well... <laughs> Let's see, out in the open, 60, 80... Go here, get full cover from them... Yeah, okay, so... Eviscerate... Gotcha. Gotcha. Interesting. Interesting. Mm 
Mm, plus two over pierces two armor, ignores weapons eight. Ignores the AP damage, minus 10 with this shit. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Ah. Thought, thought may. Ooh. Rape armor. Interesting. Eh, let's see what happens, you know. He's running away. That guy missed. Where is he? Why? What? That is the stupidest move he could have pulled. Mage, use. 1 AP. It's gone, Rogue! Oh, it's. Oh, shit, they tried to give it 4 AP. What the fuck? Actually, okay, that thing is extremely powerful. I don't want to mess with that thing. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go not mess with that thing. We're gonna go kill this guy. Yo, glory. Strip armor. And eviscerate. I don't want that guy doing anything. Miss, of course, of course, of course. Different weapon. Flanked! Why? Because we use a sniper rifle. And when you use a sniper rifle, a lot of things stop uh, existing as a threat. Uh, let's see, no, no need healing. Hmm. Boost accuracy. Probably should have done this before. Ooh, he, he knows the combat. 50-50. Oh, 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 oh. The big guy is mine. <laughs> okay, spray and pray. Shoot head. Shoot face. Unleash destruction. Eversilate opponent. Running! Damn, unlucky for me. Unlucky for him. And it's gone. Perfect. What? Even even this thing loses AP. Damn. Damn! It's a better shot than I am. And I'm a sniper. Oh, no, no, no. You don't get to... You don't get to live. Let's see if I go here, and then I go. Oh, okay, okay. It's one of those situations when I gotta do one of these. Jabba do. Jabba fucking do. See ya. Oh, boss. Can we keep it? Okay. We can't keep the merger zombie. I would like to, but we can't keep. You know, we, there is ethical concerns. Sorry for lo losing you guys your fucking ears. Target spotted, engaging. Oh baby, you have no idea what you're messing with. Missing a foreign concept. To a sharpshooter such as myself. I used to play baseball, you know. And not in some chushy Ivy League college. Beep boop, motherfuckers. Aim shot. <gasps> it's so good. What where is this drone when I want to do playthroughs as drone guy? I, uh, tri that's a trick question. Never did that play for us. As uh, a drone guy. 
never will do a playthrough as a drone guy. Uh, or sleeve. Kill them all! Third is for activating remote control rig. Why do you announce this? Well, oh, it is you know, unit cohesion. No! They shot him once! And there is so many of them. Holy shit. Don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Oh. Oh, so these, these are the games we play. <laughs> these are the games we play. Oh, we'll see about that. Oh, we'll see about that, you son of a bitch. Buff. Oh, it's time to unleash my inner... What's the name of that one, Jay? Doesn't matter. More chest brown. Maybe. Alright, may do AP damage. Let's see what happens. Miss. Uh, as expected from old glory. And this is why we have a big guy with axe here. Because big guy with axe is spooky. And uh, he likes to kill things. Mark target. And that is why you don't mess with the fucking murder golem. He's like, get that thing away from me. I don't care if there's allies in range of it. I want it dead. I hate this thing. Oh, how I hate this thing. 50 50. Miss. Eh, the further away the enemy is, the stronger my bullets become. And that is why you stay in cover. Captain Guard Contra. Alright, so we'll just uh, kill you. Like I said, kill you. You, you. you didn't hear me the first time I checked you. And then we kill you. I kill you. Kill you. Miss. This is gonna kill. No! He's running away. Grenade? He doesn't have the AP for it. He didn't level strength. Me, on the other hand, well. Shit. Pull out the coat. I leveled sniper. SMGs, actually amazing weapons. Who would have thought? Uh, that's a chill. Not a chill. Damn, he lived? For a second, I thought it was an attack. I was trying to get mad. And now we burst fire from point range. From point blank. And that's how we do it. We grab you, put that into follow mode, and we start walking. Uh, might as well use it. And start walking. We get the fuck out of here. Okay, so we got a locked door here. 
but I'm pretty sure we can just open it using one of the three door control codes we know. We need that in four. Fuck. Reload. Can I at least keep the gun? I want to keep the gun. The gun seems infinitely more useful than whatever shit they can give me. Hmm. Okay, so I can jump here and I'll start attaching. There's two. Eh, yeah, fuck it. That was a mistake on my part. There is never two. Oh, what was that? Naughty man. 75. And you on the follow, my man. Welcome to the stream. I hope you're enjoying your time here, as I am threatening friends and getting this piece of cyberware out of here. Why is it approaching? It's a mage. It's not a person. You just damaged merchandise. Uh, not, uh, not merchandise. He's human. He's human, I tell you. Not, not, a, not, a, not, not something we can sell. Right, Lori? I am, I am keenly aware that she is watching. She will at some point, maybe, attempt to kill me. This will never happen. Gotcha. Gotcha. So we got them. Now we pull out the mini gun. Now we pull out the mini gun. <laughs> uh, I love this game. I cannot remember what, what is... If I had any of these moments playing any other Shadow Engine. Maybe once we get the Bud gun in returns. But that's about it. Fuck the case right off. Uh, which of the cards are before she summon shit? Okay, that's uh, I throw you here. You should be able to do your thing. What are you? Ah, I am a. I can throw fireball. Let me get as close as humanly possible. There is nothing bad that can come from this decision. Well, I say, I say, my boy, there is certainly something bad that can come of this decision. Ever heard of gun? Ever heard of big gun? Hmm, let me introduce you to biggest gun. Re reloads like it's Fallout 76. Like it's Fallout 4. Ah, just slap in a new magazine. All right, can you open the door? <laughs> Hell yeah, we got the door unlocked. You know, after we needed it, but it's the thought that counts. We also need to find that data, which should be here. If my estimations are correct. I also need him to open that door. Eh. No wounds to heal. Ah, I see, I see. He's just half HP. Well, time to start setting up some overwatches. Oh, gotcha. 
Nothing there. There is enemies here. Of course there is enemies here. Let's see. One, two, three. And then there's the data we want. Oh, Jesus. Step one, get there. Step two, get everyone else here. Oh, I am so spoiled by XCOM 2. The ability to multi-move, really. Spoiled me. Okay, so... Go here. Open the bag of tricks heal. As for myself, well... I'm gonna hope for the best. By which I mean I'm gonna open the door. Uh, anyone that needs healing... Okay, three, two, one. Wait. Breach and clear! I was expecting some sort of reaction. Well, one in Rome, do as the Romans do. Good, I'm not blocking the door. Uh, Glory, go kill him. Max, go kill him. It's all about just showing shit. Always was. Oh, nothing. Well, in case he runs. Uh, there we go. Nothing there. Kill him. Before he can do anything. <gasps> no! There we go. Who is this? Enforcer and they have a rigger? Hmm, not a rigid. Interesting. Boost damage. Kill him. And that's why I have him on Overwatch, baby. Out of ammo, so we just... Reload. Alright, one left. Time to enter. Uh, Alright, and turn. Follow. Let me get out of your here. Get in there. Oh, I am so spoiled by X-Cons. Move the move. <laughs> Just keep the adrenaline pump pumping. Everybody else, just leave the room. Let the Decker do his thing. And, and now we can start getting some actual data. Okay. Hope for the best. Security camera. Hmm. No way, that's the only thing in here. Mm, let's see, here it is. Uh, attacker. He has an AOE. Hit a tar. Nope, that is just an exploder. What? Ah, oh, there we go. And now they're locked in an unfavorable position. Truly. The best of all worlds. Locked in the open. Can't do shit. Alright, it looks like I'm not sure that I need to go around. Because some devil designed this. 
what spawns? More of them. Of course, of course. 50. 50. <laughs> One down. Uh, erosion. Or as, uh, as Borderlands players might say. Erosion. No, you got him. Got him. Oh, what's your move? White ice, come on. White ice. Ice D. Tar, cannot move. Stuck in cover. No. <gasps> They're gonna charge. And nothing's going on in meat space. What the actual fuck? And nothing's going on in meat space. Uh, has higher chance to hit. Always done a miss though. No, I am not. I am not going to try to remember the words of that one song. I have no idea what charging does. All I know is that it's bad, which is why I use a ninety percent to stop it. Even when I miss, I hit. There is only cameras here. Ah, this is where I activate the Exploder bot. You know, he just walks to the other side and goes to blow it! One bit of potassium nitrate. Slight bit of gunpowder. One errand twitch and kablooey! Now we have access to security camera one. What did it cost? A few minutes. Ignore these pluses. It's an old game. Gotta forgive it some faults, you know? Also, my graphics card is dying. Did I forgive it? Some faults as well. There she- what the fuck? Okay, so optional, return the process. The drug formula. No one should have this drug formula. Where are we? We're here. Uh, can we open this door? I'm gonna say that's a no. So we don't hear. Uh, do you have glory in sight? Yes. Give on haste. Okay. Send her forwards. Of course she spots an enemy. Wouldn't be glory if she didn't. I see my, my dog is taking over my sweater. Can't stop him though. Why me? Why me? What did I do to you? I'm <clears throat> not. I did nothing. Oh, that's a that's a big gun. Let's tell me we can stop. All right, Bush, I can stop. Now tell me it's true. I can't lie to you, Bush. Now you see, if this was a uh, Hong Kong, you would have been able to do this without going into combat. Okay, so target designation missed. Well, Grenadier goes. Then I have a old glory. Just come in, rip his fucking throat out. 
Uh, next we have her go into the back line to kill some mages. Because mages are annoying. As for myself, the greatest man that is in this party. I am going to reload my gun. As for my other friend, well, he's going to walk. That's right, run away. Hope I don't catch you. Hope the cyber zombie doesn't catch you either. Ooh, now that is uh, bad. That is bad. What? Well, you're dead. You're now standing up. You had a cover. Uh, one more. Uh, one more. Where's the drone? And the drone, out of left field, comes out of the closet with a flanking shot. Misses. Well, damn, that is like <clears throat> slightly bad. Let me just use uh, one of these. And uh, fortune kill you. Of course, it's a miss. Of course, it's a miss. Oh, why, di why did I expect that otherwise? Why do I put faith in people? Why do I put faith in people? He will not shoot me. Do you have any idea when we saved? We never save. As you know, combat is never hard. Turns out I might be wrong on that one. I could also just suck at it. Okay, 2 AP. I need to chill it. Alright, so one shot. And if we are lucky, I need a follow through. Excellent. Alright, boys, we backed, we got back the action economy. Now I can start entering a sniper war with this guy. Okay, he missed. Excellent, excellent. Okay, so here's what's gonna happen. I am going to start shooting very hard. While this guy is gonna start killing people. Very much harder than he was already by using melee attacks. It ignores armor. Hits him in the back of that fucking head. Alright, throw one of these on yourself. He got a revive, he'll be fine.
Uh, chip drone control in the danger zone. Uh, let's see. Do I want you killed or do I want our glow save glory? I want to go save glory. He is in full cover. Fucked in the session economy. Alright, so she's revived next turn, so I'll heal you this turn. Okay, turret, what can you do? I need to I need you to save some lives. So you better get that fucking flinching shot. Okay. Ignore this half damage, so we don't need that. I need you to kill him. I'm not asking for a miracle here. That's why I'm here. They're sending in more people, of course. But this time, the chilling machine is on my team. Hmm. Come on. Oh, we're so back. Oh, we're so back. Hmm. Kill yourself. Rip and tear. Or as a okay, just shoot the gun. Why is there so many of them? Ah, shit. Ah, shit, shit, shit. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Uh, mage. Drone, shoot the mage. Now you kill what I do. Shoot the conjurer. Okay, the drone has a very big uh, dislike of mages. Excellent. Ah, uh, mark target, of course. Who is this? Enforcer, enforcer. Well, fuck you. Do just pull the... the bad roll. Spirit. Just some spirit. No, it's far away. No. Oh, I, can, I can summon elemental. Uh, yes, give me the... Da -da 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 -da. This. You see this? This is telling me uh, my graphic short design. <laughs> or it's the game. But I'm very much likely to believe it's my graphic short. Look at this fucking Far It's a wind dancer. That is a far cloud. And you cannot tell me otherwise. Oh, I can zoom. Zoom out so much. Reload. Uh, where is the cleave? Here it is. Cleave. Ah, you dirty son of a bitch. I'll get you next time. Knight Errand Enforcer. With your Fletchet gun. Why do I have such big hit chances against everyone here? Aim accuracy. <gasps> Thank you. Grenadier, Captain, Enforcer, Conjurer. Okay, step one. Let's shoot this guy. Step two. Shoot him again. And again. Okay, so... Uh, stand here. 
That should improve our chances. Okay, what can you do? Great witness, okay. One AP damage and that. I thought I was going to kill him. Not tackle him. Uh, quickness is only range combat, so. Doesn't improve melee combat. So, we. Oh, yeah, he's too heavily. I. I always thought. I was. I know I said that he's too heavily augmented to be affected by magic. But I thought it was just. But I thought. It was a possibility. It was just due to a lot of such issues. But it wasn't. Hmm. Oh yeah, this guy. Get fucked. Hmm. Hmm. What he missed? Impossible. He was just setting up the turret to shoot him. Alright. Return through them. Uh shit. Now I go after this turn. We just started in the room. Not you with this guy. No targets for cleave, so we just don't trust. Plus two damage. Plus two damage. Hmm. He's running away, hoping for the best. No wind, it will never come. Okay, I need you to dismiss spirit. To the dismiss spirit. Uh, go to this one. And now we hope that we can just... Banner Spirit, thank god. Alright, we are back in the game. I don't even see the chances. All I know is that this turret will shoot and hit 100% of the time. <gasps> no more enemies! Okay, okay. There's no more enemies. Can I save just in case? Yes, I can save. J just in case the game crashes. Okay, I... Did we have access to here? No idea, maybe? Alright, if I was a f bunch of documents, where would I hide? Hmm. Okay, looks like we can't do shit there. We if if there was a chance we missed it. Unlucky, but it is what it is. Okay, now we're gonna find our Which one is our van? Why is there so many vans? Pretty sure it's this one. Gotcha, you step into the garage with prototype in tow. Before you is it are two vehicles that you know would be waiting. Your clients and the lodges. Two decisions. Two different paydays. Decisions, decisions, eh, Chief? We're not talking about a piece of merchandise here, Blitz. That's a living troll buried under all that chrome. You're a troll, boss. Can't say envy a decision. 
close combat defense bonus. As you approach the MK6, it its head turns to track you. Its body is held at rigid attention. God, that's here, it's almost like it's waiting for something. Have glory disable the control circuits. Alright, I'll see what I can do. Now it takes a moment to examine the protrusions at the base of the MQ. Sits stall. It's fine. Then she pops the chase on the Cyber Zombies control unit. Her stall. The fingers flicker and dance in the MQ Sits circuitry. A moment later, a strange shiver runs through its body. It stumbles forward, lurching outwardly on its feet. A few seconds later, it seems to recover. It stares at its hands for a moment, then it turns to you. The MK6 speaks two words. Its voice is as brittle as broken glass. Thank you. Slowly, mechanically, the cyber zombie reaches up to grip its head in both hands, and it squeezes. Caught in the wise like grip of those heavy industrial cyber arms, the MK 6s cyber stall might as well be made of tinfoil. The air, the air fills with tortured sounds of tearing plastic and buckling steel. The MK 6 gives a final heave and its armored skull crumples like a paper cup. Its body goes slack and it topples to the ground, dead. Wood stares down at the MK Six's ruined stall, his eyes wide. Now that was unexpected. Also disgusting. Not as not as bad as letting him continue to suffer. He clearly wanted to die. Now I guess we might as well load the body into the van. Hirschmith won't be happy, but it's better than nothing. True enough. Uh, it was a combat injury. It couldn't be stopped, you know. It was our rigor against their rigor. It couldn't be stopped. The Ubaha seems especially cramped on your ride back to the Chasbasa. In your mind's eye, you can see the carnage that you left behind at the AG Chemi building. Memories have played themselves over and over in your mind. Playing visions of a hulking thing made of muscle and chrome. You put them in side shelve your fear show them for later jobs over time to collect your pay even if it's docked yo samuel anything new no nah, i just pass it by let's say hi uh okay let's see how's our resident btl added nothing new damn can I send this, send two thirds of the data? Nope. Can't sell, can't send two thirds of the data. Unlucky. Yeah, it is what it is. Hmm. Almost two hours. Eh. Good enough. Eh, good enough. Blitz. No blitz. Something big's going on. Everyone's here. You were down as. Oh, yeah. That boy. Oof. Alright, Paul, what's the news? As you step over, the rest of your team falls silent. Time to ship his dead to you. can see the war in his face. Here I have new information. I'm afraid the day ain't good news. Shit. We're listening. Two years ago, a large shipment of highly detailed radioactive bioweapon disappeared en route to a storage facility in Dresden. It was called X-15. I have traced the path of the missing shipment. It's Harfield Manor. Of course it is. Of course. It is. I've heard of this stuff before. Back in my service, we call it Doom. I run across in the wild. But I heard enough horror stories to not want to. The stories that you heard are correct. This doom is an extremely dangerous substance. I've been reading up. 
to this day, the story of Doom remains a cautionary tear in biotech circles. Monoclonal antibody technology is strictly regulated now, and this substance is one of the reasons why. So what does the stuff do? Doom kills by destroying a host muscle tissue via radioactive decay. Each individual Doom antibody is bound to a radioactive bismuth 212 isotope. When introduced into a host, these antibodies bind to surface level muscle tissue and kill it with alpha radiation. This is then repeated until the host dies. Jesus Christ. I've heard that Doom has was deployed a couple of in a couple of border skirmishes back in 41, after seeing what it did to people who are close, the UK passed away, a unilateral ban on this stuff doesn't tell you how bad it is. Nothing will. UK has. Bruh, if, if they announce something off illegal, bruh, off limits to, for everyone, fuck you know. Okay, so what does a dragon want with a nuclear bioweapon? <laughs> Nothing good. Not much goes without saying. This this development worries me. It worries me greatly. So the dragon has a bioweapon. Alright. Alright. Good to know. Doesn't change what we need to do. I want to show you this one. This is interesting. Scary, even. But it doesn't change shit. I mean, it, it ups the states in the fire winds allowed to carry out her plans, whatever those might be, but we're gonna stop before that happens. That was always the plan. As far as I'm concerned, it's still the plan. Agree with Dietrich. We need to focus on what's in front of us, whatever the dragon's larger plans might be. The fact that she is after us. We should let ourselves get distracted by anything else. Yeah, I can try. For the time being, we must continue forward. And that means you must continue working towards Alice's, raising Alice's feet. I'll leave that matter in your capable hands, for shame. When you acquire the necessary funds and ready to head back to the rabbit hole, let me know. From there, we'll discuss the next steps. If you need me, I'll be getting prepped. Right behind you, love. Come on, love. Let's go. It stuttered. I am scared. I am scared because it stuttered. Uh, in bars for no messages. One last DVD. Got to show. We got a new DVD. Jobs directory. Claim payment. Unsatisfied with been understatement. Uh, uh, in that. Oh, that from the terms of our agreement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the sabotage run. That's it. No more pending jobs. Shadowlands BBS. Anything new? Kaboom! If you had a few hours ago, then an earthquake as if as if so it went sky high downtown. Boom! You see the smoke from me. Man of mine down says it's as a power spike that blew their fucking generators. Doubt it. Only Shadowlands have that sense of flame. You're kidding me? A huge one sprang up six months ago. Plus must have cost millions to build. If it, run, if it was runners, hope they get a major payday. Nowhere to go anywhere near as if I see what it would have turned full of ammo and a mage watching my back. Honestly, the power spike version sounds more likely. I've walked past that facility and they have guards posted at door 24-7. Not to mention the automated turrets systems backing up. No way someone got paid to walk through that scheme. No way. So did this. Apparently there was some survivors wandering around Yubaha Station near the blast site. Some Bumoma. Momona boats approaching to see if uh, they had accounts. One of them said they had to keep running and they all uh, took off down the tunnel. Maelstrom. Oh, well, sure. With a blast of that, man, they probably all in a shot. But I posted about a bunch of glassy eyed people wandering around. It said they were all wearing hospital gowns. The Momona people must have hooked them off. They keep all kinds of medical gear in the rest of evidence. Maybe they were as guinea pigs. Help me find my daughter. Please help me find my daughter. She ran away from home. She is human in her early 20s with short blown hair and a data jack. She was last seen wearing a light blue dress. 
This is the place you're looking for missing kids. Well, how'd you even get in here? I, I paid good money to be in here. I will show you people could be help. You've got the knee and you came to the right place. I sent you an number that you can reach me. <laughs> the old help my help me find my missing kid routine. A classic. My money is on a safe wage slave. Make sure you do your homework, Ruby. <laughs> Tread corp traces. And I'm about to plan for when you get stuck with a tracer. Barry managed to bug out of my apartment after Corp hit squad came knocking. Let's learn to pat yourself down a couple of times and make sure you don't have a tail. But if I miss something, I'd rather keep my house safe houses, you know, safe. Ah, good luck with my RF blockers. I have a jamming grid set up near my safe house. If projects any signals to a few miles away, I got some cameras placed. So when someone shows up then, I know they were trapped trying to find me. Then I do a thorough sweep to find the tractor. Sharp, how long does that go on before they give up? Uh, usually we roll freeze, keep re-projecting a signal to a different location. In my experience, to give up after the third one is dead end. I stop listening to our signals. Okay, we data for sale. The donor list. Ah, the financial records. And there it is, boys. We did it. We have everything we need to continue with the plan. But... That will have to wait. Until next time. Oh, let me just answer a phone call. Well, that was a perfect time. That was a perfect foot. time to phone call. I'm to save the game. Since I'm already ending the stream. Gotcha. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank you all for watching. I do hope you've enjoyed. Hope I can see you next time. And, much like always. Until next time. Have a good one, ladies and gentlemen. See you. Kablooey.